Chips are here. Baby Dino. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Triennial Pterosaur Flying Competition. I am your host, and it's time to introduce you to today's contestants. Player number one is Black Whirlwind. He's already won the championship twice in a row. Can he take a third title? Let's wait and see. He'll have to watch out for player number two, Purple Lightning. He's also a favorite to take the crown. In the last competition, he performed his controversial move called the Lightning Spin. He slammed into another player and sent him to the hospital. The referees didn't disqualify him. And he's back again to race. Let's hope no one else gets in his way. As you all know, the Pterosaur Flying Competition doesn't just test flying skills, but also a racer's ability to react quickly. For every competition, the design of the obstacle course is kept a secret, so no racers have an advantage. This year, racers must face a track filled with balloon obstacles. Our staff is anxious to get started. Players, are you ready to go? <laughs> Ready? Polly still hasn't woken up. We'll have to watch the competition on TV. Um, Dylan, you watch over Polly. I need to be there for Maylee to cheer her on. Wait, I want to come with you. Great, you woke up. I have to stop being afraid. If my little sister can compete, I can be brave too. I feel better. I want to compete in the race alongside Maylee. <laughs> oh. Oh. We're too late. The race has started. All we can do is watch and wait. It's all my fault. Oh, darn! Look, it's Melee! Look, it's Melee! <laughs> He did it again! The lightning spin! It looks like some of the players are out of the race because of Purple Lightning's reckless move. The rest are coming up to the obstacle course part of the track. Come on, players! Keep it up! Oh no! Melee is hurt! Melee, come on! Guru, huh. they're coming! Get ready! All right, all right! Did you fill all the balloons with smoke powder? Yes! The smoke will stun the racers. When they can't see, we can catch them easily. Then we'll have an all-you-can-eat feast! <laughs> Great! Sneaking in and pretending to be staff members is going to pay off! The racers are coming up to another corner. Will Purple Lightning use his signature move again? <laughs> Mr. Know-it-all, well done! <laughs> I was just waiting for that impulsive purple pterosaur to be his reckless self. It was the perfect time to drop the smoke balloons and catch them all in one go. Oh my, it looks like that obstacle was a smoke balloon. One of the racers must have hit it, causing the track to fill up with smoke. They can't see. What are they going to do? I'm worried about these contestants. Melee is in danger. Huh? Huh? Let's see who comes out of the smoke first. Huh? Wait, that's player number five, who was in the waiting area, has rushed onto the track like an arrow shot from a bow. Wow, he is very experienced and is easily dashing through all the obstacles. It's amazing that this is Pally's first time in the pterosaur flying competition. This year's competition is already confusing, and now we have the addition of this newcomer. What's next? <laughs> Fly away! <gasps> Pally! I'm here to save you! Pally, you're all better! Mei Li, why would you participate in such a dangerous race? Your wings haven't fully recovered yet! This time, I will definitely protect you! 
You messed up a sure thing again! Don't worry, I have another trick up my sleeve. There's a white net at the finish line. I've rigged it with an electromagnetic charge that will shock the racers. They'll have nowhere to escape and we can grab them! Ah. <laughs> Ellie, watch out for his lightning spin! <gasps> there are two players in the smoke battling for the lead! Look! It's Pally! He saved his sister! Hmm. The two racers are getting close to the finish line. Let's see who makes it through the net first to grab the win. It's going to be close. The badge. They are in danger. Let's transform. Garu, Garu, go, Dino! You stop this! Huh? We meet again, little fly. Let them go! That depends on if you can stop me! Hurrah! <coughs> Hold on! Watch your right! Guru! Aha! I'm here to help you! <laughs> I'll get the others loose. Get to the finish quickly! The obstacle net is an ambush! The racers are in danger! Got it, bro! As expected, the first player out of the smoke is Purple Lightning! Right after him is the number five player, Pally! Wait a minute, he seems to be carrying player number six, who appears to have a broken wing! They are flying neck and neck. Can newcomer Pally overtake the experienced Purple Lightning? Pally, watch out! <laughs> huh? Ah! <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> wow! <laughs> Phew! That was close! A new champion is born! Congrats to player number five, Pally! Way to go! I knew my training would work! I did? Dear viewers, we regret to inform you that there have been some changes to the winners. First, let's congratulate Black Whirlwind, who sacrificed his position to rescue trapped players number three and number four. It was the right thing to do. Caring for others is more important than winning a competition. Next, the referee declared Purple Lightning's dangerous moves to be a major foul. To ensure the safety and fairness of the game, he has been disqualified, and his runner-up position is cancelled. Oh no! As for players 5 and 6, even though player 5 crossed the finish line first, he was late for the race and should not have been competing. And while player 6 technically crossed the finish line second, she was carried by player 5, so she didn't fly to the end. All of this is against the rules, so they are both disqualified. It's all right. Sometimes simply getting yourself in the game is more important than winning. <laughs> Great. We look forward to your wonderful future performances. Just don't be late next time. Hallie, thank you for saving me. You will always be my bravest hero. Brave little dinosaur. Ah! Oh, it looks kind of ragged. Oh.